located about 30 million light years away, ESO 495-21, also known as Heinz 210, is a dwarf starburst galaxy around 3,000 light years in diameter, containing just 3% of the mass of the Milky Way. In 2011, a radio wave source was pinpointed that corresponded to an earlier X-ray source at the same location. The balance of radiation levels in these different wavelengths pointed to the presence of a giant black hole accreting material from its surroundings. Based on these findings, the supermassive black hole is around one million solar masses. That's a quarter of the size of the supermassive black hole Sagittarius A star at the center of our galaxy. The origin of the central supermassive black holes in galaxies is still a matter of debate. Do galaxies form first and then crash material at their centers into black holes? Or do pre-existing black holes gather galaxies around them? Or do they evolve together? Or could the answer be something else entirely? With its small size, indistinct shape, and rapid starburst activity, astronomers think this galaxy may be an analog for some of the first galaxies to have formed in the cosmos. Finding a black hole at this galaxy's center is a strong indication that black holes formed first, with galaxies developing later and evolving around them.